What is up, everyone? This is Kate with Skywolf Game Studios. Hope you all had a nice Valentine's Day with your special someone. No, I did. Went to Orlando yesterday and went to Dave and Buster's with my wife. Okay, so today we're looking at a platform called Easy VFX. They have lip sync, and that's what I'm particularly interested in. They also have mocap which you've kind of seen me touch a little bit on with Quick Magic AI. And this is essentially a similar thing. I'm currently thinking about testing that next, but today we are mostly looking at the lip sync because I wanted to see how that plays out. So how do we do this? Well, you can get the plugin from Blender Market, soon be renamed Superhive, and add it to your cart, and then view your order and download the plugin, or you can just get it from easyvfx.ai. So you want to sign up for a new account, but the first thing we want to do before we even do that is get the plugin and the demo project. I'm going to use the demo project. They do support um, Rickify and models with ARKit. So that's important to notice. Uh, they're, they currently also have two subscription plans. Basic, which is basically free. And then Creator, which is $7 per month. So let's go ahead and download the project and plug in so we can get started. It's going to take you to this page. Um, you can want to check the prerequisites. Over here it says Blender 4.1 and lower and then 4.2. This is actually out of date because if you look over here on the Blender market, you can actually see it works with Blender 4.3. And I have tested it with Blender 4.3 already. And it does work. So let's go back over here. We want to get downloads and download the plugin from Gumroad. And I'm just going to put zero and purchase again. You can donate if you want, that would be super awesome. And can see get we have to do zero there we go and it'll take you to this page um you don't have to do it from gumroad if you don't want to you could do it actually from blender market so right here and i've already paid for it so i'm just gonna Get it from here. I already canceled that one anyway. So it says 4.2, but don't worry about that. And we also want to download the demo project for Blender. Go ahead and click that. They are working on a plugin for Unreal Engine and Unity, so that's going to be really cool. Definitely going to try that out as soon as that becomes available. Okay. So, let me see here. Alright, so let's flip back to the demo project and you just want to click this top one. Kind of wish I could download the plugin straight from here. I'm not sure why it kicks me to Gumroad. Um, because this one you can download. It's kind of strange that that happened, but it is what it is, so we're just going to roll with it. Okay, so we're going to open up the folder. Let me just close that down. We are going to extract. And then open up the sample. And here we are. Here's the demo character, and if you hit play... Easy VFX plugin for Blender. Hi there, I am Matilda. My lip sync works fully automatically with the Easy VFX plugin for Blender. Hi... Uh, 
that's what the demo project goes you with it's a basic sample so what we want to do now is go to edit preferences and click the little arrow up at the corner install from disk go to downloads and let's just type in easy and we want to make sure we click the lip sync and then install from disk and it should install easy vfx lip sync if it does not make sure that you try to search for it with easy and then make sure that the box is ticked so it's enabled you can check this on the right side I just close out of that and it'll say easy vfx over here as long as you have this panel here with the end key to hide and show it you're good to go and then now what we need to do is jump back over here to their website and sign up you click that but i've already created an account so i'm just gonna log in it's gonna log me in and what we need is our api key and grab it right here with copy and go back into blender and you want to put it in this spot right here for user token just copy and paste it and then save token it's going to say your token is saved and now we are ready to rock and roll fully so what i would suggest is right clicking over here and then split horizontal I'm going to change this top one to the text editor and this is the file right here you can work with. You can exit off if you don't want to use that one. So I'm going to do that. Delete. I'm going to do new and I'm going to be like, hey there, I'm there. Huh? Hey, very nice to meet. We'll see how long we can make this go. There is a limit on the subscription plan. So for the basic plan, you get up to 88 seconds. And for the creator plan, you can get up to 60 minutes. So let's do... Welcome to this tutorial. Studios. Let's see of easy. Let's see how that works. There we go. Okay, and you just want to make sure that this right here, text component, matches that, and that way it reads this. Um, I would also recommend saving. Save as my text. Personally, I'm just going to get rid of their logo. Just because mine's going to sit in the corner anyway, and it's going to block it. Uh, but I just want it as, as least distractions as possible. Uh, if we select her head, we can see this is the animation on her face. So now we want to make sure this source is on text, which is using this text file that we created. And they have two voice engines, Eleven Labs and Azure. I have not tried Azure yet. I've mostly done Eleven Labs, so I'm just going to stick with what I know for the moment. And now we want to select your voice. You got a couple in here. One, two, three. Yeah, no, wait. 
Yeah. Looks like three females and the rest are boys, I think. I'm not sure what Callum is. That is that a boy name or a girl name? Um, um oh well. Uh, there's Alice and then there's Charlotte. I like Charlotte. Uh, Alice sounds a little too robotic to me, so I think Charlotte sounds a little better. So now what we want to do is click process audio. It's going to start generating the audio. And now if you press play. Hey there, I'm Sarah, and it's so very nice to meet you. Welcome to this tutorial on lip syncing with Skywolf Game Studios, courtesy of Easy VFX. And if that sounds good, just go ahead and save audio. I'm just going to do um, sample two and then save that. And now the problem is if we press there, play, it's going to go back to the default. We don't, we don't want that. We want to get her to talk about ours. We need to now switch this to audio. Load the file that we saved, which is sample two. And switch the emotion. Uh, first, actually, first you need to actually process that. I almost forgot that step. And then I'll say loaded, so you're good there. So now on the STL. Switch this to like happy or neutral, whatever you want. You only got three options in here. I kind of wish there was more in there personally. So maybe we'll get more in an update. So I'm going to put it as happy. I'm going to name the animation. Uh, happy test anim or something. I can't spell. And then create animation. Error. Hmm. Uh, one sec. All right. So I had gotten an error right there because I ran out of credits. My plan was for had ended on the 14th and I haven't used it in a little while so I just need to resubscribe or you can just buy credits if you need them it looks like so anyway I did that all right so let's just check to make sure the audio hey there I'm Sarah and it's so very nice Sounds to good. meet you welcome to this tutorial on lip syncing with Skywolf Game Studios courtesy of Easy VFX sounds good still all right so now I want to generate the animation. We named it. Let's go ahead and create the animation. Process of animation generation has ended. So now what we need to do is um, go to this bottom one, switch to the shape key editor, and switch the sample animation over to the new one. And this one looks like it's longer for some reason, so we're just going to make it that way. I think like 280 is good. Go to let's switch back over to the getting a little click happy right here timeline, and I'm just gonna bump this up to 280.
Hi there, I am Matilda. And it's still wrong. Because there's one other important step. And that is go over here to the video editor. And you want to take the sample right here and select it. And then over here under source, just X that off and then click open and we want our sample and open sound and now if we go back over here we should hear ours with the speech matching hey there i'm sarah and it's so very nice to meet you welcome to this tutorial on lip syncing with sky and it looks like it got cut off for some reason i think I need to drag that out further. Yeah, it was cut off, I think. Just gonna make that match almost to the end. Let's try it again. Hopefully it fixed it now. Hey there, I'm Sarah, and it's so very nice to meet you. Welcome to this tutorial on lip syncing with Skywolf Game Studios. Courtesy of Easy VFX. Hey there, I'm Sarah. There we go. And it's so very nice to And that's you. how you do that. Welcome to this tutorial on But that's pretty cool because now you can use this for like your own movie and whatnot and create lip syncing. And now you could render out a video on it or something like that. Or make your own character with AR shape keys and add some limps easy lip syncing the process is pretty simple we did this in about 17 minutes um, but anyway I think this is really really cool and I cannot wait for the Unreal Engine plugin to come out that's gonna be really cool since I work a lot between the two I think I'm probably going to try this out on a different character of my own. And if I do, I will go ahead and update this video or release a follow-up. Um, I haven't quite decided yet, but anyway, I just wanted to show you this is what you can use for making your characters talk, which is fantastic. And there you go. Okay, so I'm going to stop here, and all right, that is all. You guys take care. I'll see you next time.